Hello there, this is John from uh, National Travel Concierge, and as you see right now, I am at the corner of 4th Avenue North and uh, Union uh, Street in Nashville, Tennessee, and we're going to be walking from here to where I normally park at and uh, when I come to work, and I'm going to show you what's on 4th Avenue North, and it's a little bit chilly here, but uh, we'll see what we can do. Right across the street from where I'm at is Ellington's. It's uh, a really nice restaurant, uh, and... Uh, you know, they have some rooms there also for people, but it's a, it's a hotel slash restaurant. And uh, um, to my left, we see an empty building. And uh, there was a breakfast place here one time, but uh, at this time there was nothing. And we're gonna go walking down the street a little bit. And if you look across the street again, you're gonna see Valaro's, which happens to be the oldest restaurant in Nashville, the oldest eating establishment. That is not its original location, but it's been owned by the same family. Uh, here we go, right there. And right next to them is Khan's uh, Mongolian Barbecue. And to my left is, well, right next to uh, a law firm, we have Muse Inspirational Fashion, which uh, I've never been in there, but I'm sure it inspires a lot of people. Okay, we're gonna keep walking. And as we look across the street, we're gonna see Jay Gumbo's and it's uh, it's part of the arcade. And for those of you who don't know, the arcade is going through a, a reformation, which means that a lot of the stores that, that have been there for years are, uh, well, their, uh, their rent has not been renewed. And so uh, their days are numbered. It's gonna be kind of made up and we see somebody crossing the street and he's, uh, who the heck knows who he is? Anyway, and this is the Bobby Hotel. Bobby Hotel is uh, it's known for quite a lot. Let me see, it's one of the uh, boutique, uh, it's one of the boutique uh, hotels here on, on 4th Avenue North. Uh, and if you notice, there was a, a bus on the top of there. So right here we have the Wells Fargo Bank. And I'm gonna, go across the street show you what's over here we have Philadelphia uh, steak and we have BAM burgers okay and I have eaten at neither one of them but again here we have right next to the Wells Fargo Bank we have Bankers Alley let's take a look and see what you find down there you take a look down at Bankers Alley there's a sign up there and that says Skulls Rainbow Room. Skulls happens to be uh, part of Prince's Alley and I, I did a video on that and you'll see uh, up above the, uh, the link to the vi video I did for Printer's Alley and this is a pretty interesting place right here and right next to uh, attached, well actually attached to the same building that has Skulls we have this building right here which uh, is owned or if it was bought by the Sinatra family and they're gonna be putting in a bar right there in the near future and that should be pretty exciting hey, okay and over here we have the Tennessee Bar Center it looks like a actually it looks like a a, uh, a barber shop and we have another barber shop I want to keep walking And that says kebabs and gyro. A lot of these places are actually not open. Uh, they closed because of COVID. And um, hopefully things are getting better. And there is the Italian kitchen. Uh, they're not open right now. I actually don't know when they are open. This place here is another place that was closed because of COVID. It was called uh, Witch Witch. Which which a sandwich place, and again I've been here for almost seven months and it's never been open. Got a parking lot across the street. Let's just keep walking. And okay, across the street, Fourth and well, right straight across the street that is uh, Church and Union with all the bottles in the window. Uh, that's actually one of the uh, better places to eat here in Nashville. I recommend it all the time. And attached to that is a Chase Bank. And right here is Stateside Kitchen. State, Stateside Kitchen. 
is uh, part of the Dream Hotel. And here's the entrance for the Dream. And I, I mentioned the Bobby Hotel a few uh, about a block back. Well, there's three different three different boutique type hotels here. One is the Bobby, one is the Dream, and you'll see the third one just coming up shortly. And we're almost at the corner of Church and Union. I mean, sorry, Church and Fourth Avenue South. Let's try it again. We're almost at the corner of Fourth Avenue North and Church, and you'll see the Noel. Noel is the third of these uh, artsy uh, boutique type hotels. Very cool. And if you look to your left, this says uh, it's one of the restaurants attached to the Noel. They have one of the uh, best uh, brunch restaurants here. It's called Make Ready. And if you come to Nashville, you're going to probably need a uh, reservation for it. And I'm coming up to the corner of Church and 4th Avenue North. Over here across the street, that is Deacon's New South, a pretty good steak restaurant. And I'm looking across the street, and as I cross, you can see the sign for Printer's Alley right there. It's one of the entrances. Here we have a Courtyard Marriott. And we're just gonna keep walking. It's not very far till I uh, get to my parking space. Or the courtyard. Now, one thing I do want to tell you is if you're on 4th Avenue North and you're at the Courtyard Marriott, you'll notice the, the uh, Starbucks sign. They do have a Starbucks here. The problem is that if you use points or uh, if you pay with the app, uh, you can't do it. You can't use your points to get drinks. And so uh, there is another Starbucks over on Church Street and 5th Avenue, just letting you know. Okay, here is another, uh, it's a, what's it called? It's called a uh, chili burrito. Okay, it's a cool, hot, and uh, it's a cool, hot grill. That's what it says. Anyway, I haven't eaten there either. It looks like they're, they're planning on building a uh, subway here, and uh, I just peeked inside as we passed. There wasn't a whole lot there. And I'm about to enter where I parked at which is uh, part of One Nashville. Okay, right here is Thai Super Sandwiches. Uh, it's real popular. Again, I've never been there, but they support the Predators, if you see the sign in the window. And so that's a good thing. Now the building over here, I'd like to show this off to you because it's uh, 150 uh, 4th Avenue North. It's uh, called One Nashville. Well, let's kind of look up there and see how tall this thing is. And, uh, I'm pointing this out to you because two of the floors in this building are rented out to TikTok. And uh, on that note, there's a lot of things going on here in Nashville. And I'm going to head for my car and I'm going to put this online as soon as I can. I hope you guys have a great day. It's kind of a, a blustery, a windy day here in Nashville. And so just have a have a have a great day and uh, hit like and subscribe and do whatever and there'll be another video out in the next couple days you guys take care